Hello. Hello again. Oh, Mumblebee. Hi there, Stephen Coghill here from my studio in Hagerstown, Maryland. I got this thing online for 19 bucks from a company called Woot, and I'll, the link is below. We're going to check this out and see if $19 is good for voiceover and music. Let's see. All right, let's do an unboxing of the Bumblebee 2 and find out what's inside. Now, I've already, full disclosure, I bought this, so they didn't send it to me. And I also haven't tried it, but I did open it. All right, so there's a box within a box. And, you know, Neat is always known for having their giant packaging, and this is no different. So a giant box and then another giant box. But, you know, it protects things, so that's always good. All right, opening that up, we have uh, the instructions. Nice. You get a six-foot USB-C cable. Yep. And you also get an adapter for if you're using a smaller tripod, you can put that on the bottom of the microphone. And then inside here, obviously, is the mic. Hello, Mike. What's up, buddy? All right. I'm going to take that out of the package. And something went flying. There's this little thing on here that tells you what the button does, and we'll look at that in a second. Yeah. All right. Well, this is the mic. Pretty nice. This is like metal. Metal, 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 metal. The only thing that I feel is plastic is this base here. But I know this from looking at it before. You can take this off and put this on a mic stand, which is exactly what we're going to do, because how much fun is that? All right, we can put that. This has got a standard thread right on there, the 5 8 thread. We're going to go ahead and put it on a microphone and see how it goes. Let's go. You know, I've seen a lot of people spinning the microphone around when they're putting these on. And the easy way is just to release it from here and then just screw it on. So much easier. And the back end makes a nice way to tighten it. All right. There we go. Mounted. Properly mounted. All right. Now we're going to plug it in. All right, now we're going to plug it in with our USB cable. The supplied USB cable. People like to throw these away, but a lot of these cables that come with these uh, USB components are actually meant to run on these components. And so you try to use another one and you don't get the same performance. So make sure to always use the same cable that came with your component, microphone, whatever it is. Interface. Use the cable that came with it, if you can. Now, I noticed on the bottom of this, and I'll have some close-ups, there is the USB port, which we're going to use on the bottom, but there's also the headphones. And we're going to plug some headphones in there, too, just to make sure we're uh, using this properly. And we're going to go ahead and plug it in, and I bet there's, like, some cool lights. Let's see if, you got, if I can actually plug it in. Ready? Here you go. Plug it in. I need an adapter. Okay, let's plug it in and see what it does. All right, it flashed once. Neat. I broke it. It's not showing up. Bump, bump. Oh, I didn't plug it in all the way. Oh, there you go. Plugged it in. Now we're going to go ahead and use it as a device, so it's using it as an input and as the output. I'm going to go ahead and plug some headphones in. All right, so it took me a second to figure out what I was doing with this microphone. As far as the buttons go, because you can, as you can see, you can switch the colors on the front, and they each correspond to different things. Sorry, touching the microphone. But blue is basically, as you can see on the screen, the louder I put it up, whoa, the louder it gets. We don't want to put it that loud, but uh, looking at the screen, we're getting good input from there. And actually, this microphone sounds really good. I'm really impressed with the microphone itself as far as the quality and everything. Now, the noise floor. But wow, I mean, really impressed with this microphone as far as the clarity 
That's my stomach. Yeah, I really like this mic. Sounds great. This is what it would be like to voice something with it. And as far as I'm concerned, it sounds really good. For a USB microphone for 19 bucks. Wow. Yeah, loving it. Ba, 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 ba. So this is the gain for the microphone, the blue mode on the front. So you can change it to the three modes. And I put it in the blue mode and I can turn up the microphone as you can see in here. And then we're gonna turn that back down. And uh, I do have my air conditioning on. Let me turn that off. We have a Martin DC 1E today for our test. I'm about 12 inches away. I've got it aimed about this portion of the guitar. And let's see how it sounds. Nice. Nice. Okay, so for today's test, we're using my Cog Hill Custom Tele with a uh, Ken Armstrong uh, P90 in the neck and some other, I don't even know what's in the bridge, but I love it. Anyway, here we go. There's the clean tone. Nice. All right. Um, yeah, that's putting some good uh, signal to tape, as they say in the business. All right. Let's go to the middle position. Next. Nice. How about some juice on there? Yes! Woo! All right, so in conclusion, do I think this microphone is a good voiceover microphone? Absolutely. Is this a good microphone for musicians? Absolutely. Horn players? Absolutely. Guitar players? Percussion? Really, you can use it on anything. For $19. For reels. For reels, man! <laughs> And it comes in this really nice thing. And it also got some really cool stuff. And you're going to love it. Anyway, you should get it. It's a really good microphone. I love how you can mount it. Um, I, and the little lighty things, although very confusing because the output, uh, when I go to the orange thing, only turns up the, the output from my computer. So that's a little weird. So, yeah. Um, really the blue is where it's at and that's going to increase woo, the levels and all that stuff and the sensitivity. Um, the hiss you're hearing is the, the, the MacBook fan is going cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, but we're not going to let that make our recording unsatisfactory. All right. So in conclusion, $19, pick one up before they're gone. Link is below. I've been Steven, you've been you, and let's get out of here.